let's take a look at this Nintendo Switch. It's Nintendo's latest uh, handheld console. Costs around uh, 30,000 rupees or around uh, 460 dollars or so. It's an uh, import. Nintendo doesn't uh, officially launch video games in India. And uh, this is what you get in the box. You get some uh, cables and uh, quite a few other accessories. You get this dock for your uh, controllers and a dock for your uh, Nintendo Switch so that you can uh, play your games on TV. This is how a Nintendo Switch console looks. You get a really big screen and um, it's quite slim too. It takes memory cards. That's the volume button. That's the power button. Headphone jack. That's how you charge the device. It also comes with a stand. So you can prop it up like this and play it. You can use these uh, by putting into this cradle. Now you can use this as a controller. It's quite big though. Release them. You press this button. Or you can connect these to these covers. And uh, use them use them like this in a two player games or you can connect these to the switch there is a little bit of learning period because the grip is so unique you get two triggers and two shoulder buttons two joysticks and uh, four buttons this is the screen capture button. It only takes photos though. This is the home button. Even uh, these are plus and minus are also buttons used in different games. So let's turn on the device. The screen is a touch screen. So you can uh, click on it to see the battery life. To unlock it, press any buttons three times. And it unlocks. This is how the interface looks. It's way better than uh, other uh, Nintendo consoles. This is really refreshing to see. And uh, you can see all your games lined up in a row. And below you can see the news Nintendo eShop where you can buy software. Luckily, this time the games are not uh, region locked. Album controllers system settings these are some of the settings you can change getting in and out of games is also really quick it loads the games really quickly That's the actual uh, load time. The quality is really amazing, especially on uh, Nintendo games. To quit the game, all you need to do is uh, press the home button. Now you can close the game. It's a really amazing handheld console battery life is the only issue it doesn't last more than three to four hours you should never buy a console just to play one game but uh, zelda on this is uh, 
Dan God. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this bubblegum. It's by Lotte. It's called a Sport. Splashes your mouth with freshness. This is grape flavor. That's PM mint flavor. Last one is the cinnamon flavor. Really colorful packaging. You get seven pieces in a, each of them. Each of these costs around uh, 16 rupees or around uh, 20 cents or so. Really colorful looking packaging. Has a two years shelf life. Chewing gum with a cinnamon flavor. Ingredients are a gum base, corn syrup, fructose syrup, servitol solution, artificial flavor, sucrose, fatty acid, water, propylene glycol, and a sorbitol solution made in a Republic of Korea. It has cinnamon flavoring in the middle. It's soft and chewy. Nice cinnamon flavor. Let's try the spearmint one. Really refreshing spearmint flavor. This has a nice grape flavor. All of them are really good flavors. If I had to choose, I would choose the spearmint one. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this Maruti Suzuki booth at Auto Expo. These are some of their popular models. The partnership is going really strong. They are leading in uh, most of the categories. They had this interesting uh, merchandise section. And some uh, Suzuki bikes were on display. Looks really menacing. Some interesting looking models. This brand is popular because of their uh, low prices and uh, the value for money you get. This is their uh, new launch. And uh, it's been updated with the rounder curves. This is quite a controversial bike because of its huge bodywork, which is just a plastic shell. Some unique looking vehicles. Most of the vehicles are uh, leading in their category.
the older version of this card was quite boxy. This is much more rounded. They also had quite a few engines on display. This is a boat engine. They had their uh, Moon Rover, the Google X Prize one. And their uh, racing car. Their uh, famous K Series engine. And their uh, dual jet was also on display. They are already releasing uh, styling add ons for the new car. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this candy. These are sour cherry drops by Cavendish and uh, Harvey. Sugar free. Come in this beautiful can. Made in Germany. Cherry flavored candy with uh, sweetener. Ingredients are uh, sweetener, isomalt, malt syrup, citric acid, coloring uh, plant extract, which is beetroot, cherry juice concentrate, natural flavoring, sweetener, lassia flame, may contain traces of milk, confectionery for uh, connoisseurs, it also had the same info on the back, it's a vegetarian product, costs around uh, 300 rupees or around uh, six dollars or so. So let's taste it. That's how the candy looks. You get a lot of cherry flavor. Very tasty. There is a hint of sourness. It's also nicely sweetened. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this talking alarm clock. It's by Orpat. Costs around 425 rupees or around $9 or so. India's largest timepiece manufacturer. It also has a temperature display. These are some of the features. Talking alarm timepiece, LCD with blue backlight, 10 minute snooze function, temperature, 3 melodies, 4 step bip sound, 1 minute auto stop alarm, night 9 pm to 7 am talking shut off function, every hour time talking. It's manufactured in a Gujarat, India. This is how you set the clock. That's the warranty card. And it has a few settings. How to snooze. How to change the temperature from a centigrade to Fahrenheit. And the ability to turn off screen light. It uses uh, two AA batteries. It shows temperature below, really big display. The clock is slightly angled, so you can see it uh, even while sleeping in your bed. These are the controls to change the mode, to change uh, hours from 12 to 24. And you use this to change the temperature uh, from centigrade to Fahrenheit takes two AA batteries to know the time just press on the clock it also lights up while talking so you can see the clock when you press these buttons get clicked that's how it talks so 
it needs to be kept on a hard surface like a table beautifully designed clock and uh, quite a nice talking function quite nice check it out let's take a look at this pina colada it's a non-alcoholic drink by twist ready to drink i thought this was dirt on the packaging but it's actually water splashes i haven't tried the alcoholic version of pina colada so i can't compare this is a nice way to try all the alcoholic drinks it's a non-carbonated pineapple drink with a coconut flavor fruit content nine percent pasteurized ingredients water sugar concentrated whole milk pineapple juice concentrate acidifier citric acid acidity regulators stabilizers pectin coconut milk natural coconut and a pineapple aroma invert sugar syrup antioxidants aspartic acid modified starch colorants it has about uh, 500 calories looks like it's made in austria so let's taste it that's how it looks let's taste it this costs around uh, 195 rupees or around uh, four dollars or so the drink has a really amazing flavor you would think milk pineapple and uh, coconut wouldn't go well together but it goes surprisingly well smells amazing tastes even better the pineapple dominates the flavor there is a nice coconut aftertaste and, uh, it's very milky really good quite nice check it out i think more companies should use this packaging it's made out of paper it's really durable it's perfect size to hold and uh, drink out of this was yamaha's booth at uh, auto expo some really unique looking bikes This one looked uh, quite regal. Interesting uh, gold trim. They had uh, quite a few scooters, which has a really big market in India. This was their uh, new launch. Looks very unique. They had this unique looking self balancing bike. It uses those uh, three weights to balance itself. It's weird to see those uh, stabilizing weights. That makes it look uh, not that impressive. I think they should have removed those. Another uh, interesting uh, scooter. They were uh, quite heavily promoting scooters. That's how the instrument dial looks. Quite nice. Check it out. Let's take a look at this buttermilk chicken at Pavilion in uh, ITC Moria. That's how it comes. It's thin and crispy. nice and juicy you don't even need any of these tips let's try the mint one really nice mint flavor this is the honey lemon drizzle it's a sweet dip you would think it wouldn't work with the uh, chicken but um, 
it works surprisingly well let's try it with some lemon as it definitely improves it this costs around uh, 450 rupees around uh, 8 dollars or so let's try it with this uh, herb oil again uh, really good all the other ingredients add an extra dimension to the dish let's try it with some uh, salad really tasty dish quite nice check it out let's take a look at this fun school cricket board game two players can play it those are the rules costs around uh, 299 rupees or around uh, six dollars or so that's the whole thing it's made out of cardboard with two dials the scoreboard on top which you need to set it to zero before you begin to play it one player chooses to bowl and the other player chooses to bat and you just move the dials score the points each player takes turn batting and bowling each over has uh, six balls you can choose uh, how many overs you want to play gives you random deliveries and uh, random shots and the batting team is playing really well very simple instructions and uh, very easy to play whenever you bowl an over ball you have to bowl an extra ball they ask you to choose the exact uh, delivery that's displayed but it's more fun if you choose randomly finally you get a wicket all the points are uh, clearly visible on the scoreboard it's quite fun to play the whole thing is made out of cardboard and it doesn't need any batteries makes no sound which is always a plus you can set how many overs you want to play and for how many wickets scoring and bowling gives you random results so there is definitely a element of luck very innovative quite nice check it out let's take a look at this biscotti it comes in this really beautiful packaging traditional artisan style italian cookies italiano authentic di bella they've been around since 1863 that's how the biscotti looks it's blueberry lemon rich dried blueberry enveloped within the bright lemon flavors this italian indulgence is perfect for dunking or a light snacking you get six cookies inside it's natural no artificial color flavor or a preservative is used each serving has about 130 calories ingredients are wheat flour sugar eggs palm oil blueberry juice infused uh, cranberries dried cranberries sugar blueberry juice sunflower oil natural blueberry flavor water candied lemon peel baking powder sodium bicarbonate mono potassium tartrate corn starch soybean oil natural flavors salt baking soda and uh, soy lechon this costs around uh, 595 rupees or uh, 10 dollars or so five generations of family tradition how the recipe was developed that's the Dibella family the 
that's how it looks let's test it it's really crumbly amazing lemon flavor the blueberries are really soft the lemon is so fragrant it has really amazing flavor and uh, fragrance i think definitely worth the price quite nice check it out this is kia motors booth at uh, auto expo they just set up a brand new factory in india and uh, they are uh, all set to launch all their vehicles in india in uh, 2019 so no prices are uh, announced yet they have some really beautiful looking cars this is their uh, stinger gt really sleek very low to the ground nice looking front end interesting wheels this is cadenza front and actually goes in interesting design elements the stinger actually looks good in red really flashy looks even better up close really slick designs the interior is color matched they had a vr thing some of their other uh, car models looks like they have a car for uh, every segment interesting to see the front end with the uh, four leds and these are uh, headlamps if they are uh, priced right i think they will do really well in india i'm guessing this is their uh, entry level they also had a few electric vehicles interesting to see all of them are using the same type of plug so we won't have any compatibility issues that's how the back looks this is the plug in hybrid quite nice check it out let's take a look at this premium organic chocolate from tree to bar it got silver at the international chocolate awards 2016 this is organic chocolate with passion fruit beautiful packaging passion fruit and a 60% cacao it's organic soy free gluten free vegan pure arabia national cacao socially responsible ingredients are a organic cacao mass organic cane sugar organic cacao butter organic dehydrated passion fruit emulsifiers sunflower lechon this pack has a uh, five servings each serving is about 60 calories 
it's manufactured in uh, Ecuador. It's by House of Mandara. This costs around uh, 450 rupees or around uh, $9 or so. So let's taste it. That's how it looks. Let's taste it. Who knew passion fruit and chocolate won't go so well together? It has a hint of bitterness from the chocolate and the amazing uh, flavor of passion fruit. And uh, both of them combine beautifully, even with uh, such a small bite. I got so much flavor of cacao and uh, passion fruit. Quite nice. Check it out.